Hi everyone, it is Laura Reinhardt from the Suzy Lou blog and today I am joining up with some very lovely ladies to um, join the Golden Vlog series. And so I'm very excited. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Um, it is the end of the day. Um, I got home from work. I am in my comfy clothes as you can see. Got me some Maleficent repping some Disney going on here. <laughs> um, and I have a few minutes. Um, before I need to start getting ready for dinner and then I have to go to rehearsal at the theater tonight. Um, I am recently just been cast in Miracle on 34th Street so I'm very excited about that and I, I do apologize. I'm not sure how the lighting is um, you know for the video. I hope it's okay. It's really dreary here today. We have tornado warnings um, so hopefully it won't get too bad. Alright here we go. So, um, I am enjoying um, the cooler weather. Um, I love, absolutely love this time of the year um, with the various holidays, Halloween, Thanksgiving, Christmas, the whole nine yards, um, wearing big sweaters and scarves. I'm a huge fan of scarves. I have tons of scarves in my closet and just pulling out all those, um, like your fall attire, like boots and things like that, uh, learning. Woo! Well, I'm in grad school right now. I am actually um, getting my master's in public administration with a concentration in nonprofit so that I can become an executive director of a theater one day. So I've been learning a lot, reading a lot, writing a lot, and um, trying not to um, have panic attacks a lot. <laughs> I'm thankful for, gosh, there's so much I'm thankful for, and this past week was really, really hard, and I'm just thankful for all of you who've shown your love and support, but it made me stop and think of um, the things that I'm thankful for, for my family, my friends, for the opportunities that have been presented to me through um, working with the theater, um, my job. Um, looking forward to, um, I have a lot of fun things coming up. Um, I've got hopefully a photo shoot coming up with um, my brother and his girlfriend. We are actually um, planning on going to one of the sites that they film the Hunger Games at. Um, and I live really close to that, um, the site that they use for part of District 12. So we're going to go there and do kind of a fall photo shoot with them. And um, hopefully I will be getting some headshots taken uh, the, the same day I do that shoot as well. Um, I'm looking forward to the holidays again, spending time with family, seeing family I don't get to see all the time, um, which is always fun. Oh, craving. Mm. I'd have to say, um, with everything that's happened the past week, I really just am craving, just, I really want to just spend time with the people that are closest to me and, um, I may be 27 years old, but I'm a huge kid at heart and so I love watching Disney movies and my best friend um, my best friends they're the exact same way and so I'm um, just getting together with them and uh, watching either watching our favorite TV shows or just spending time together um, crafting um, as far as foods I guess craving I'm always I love um, Vietnamese food um, my go-to, especially on a day like this where it's nasty and rainy outside and cold, I love to get the um, pho or pho, I think is how is it pronounced, um, and it's just a wonderful, like yummy, cozy soup, and uh, with noodles in it, and you can get it with chicken or you know whatever protein you want in it, but it's absolutely wonderful, and I always get um, spring rolls. Um, fresh spring rolls with their peanut dipping sauce and it's absolutely fantastic and yeah I might have to go pick some up later on tonight. Um, reading. I wish I could say that I um, was reading something fun. Um, the only fun thing I could say that I read is when I get on blog loving, blog loving and I read all my blogs that I follow. Um, and I love doing that. I love catching up with everybody and commenting and seeing all the cool things that everybody's making and and whatnot. Um, so, and yeah, I got really far behind this past week. I'm playing catch up just because of kind of really taking last week off. Um, and I had close to 700 blog posts that I had yet to read. So I caught up quite a bit today. Um, 
but yeah, but other than that, I'm reading books for grad school, which um, are thrilling. Mm -hmm. um, let's see, watching, woo! Welcome to fall television season, am I right? Um, I am currently watching, I watch Dancing with the Stars, um, I watch Dance Moms and Kim of Queens. Um, <laughs> I, let's see, uh, I watch American Horror Story and I'm the biggest chicken in the world so that is a big deal for me but I, the writing is absolutely spectacular. Um, I watch a lot of TV. Oh gosh, what else do I watch? Um, I watch uh, How to Get Away with Murder. It's absolutely fantastic. I'm watching Rain. Uh, Megan Follows, who played Anne Shirley in Anne of Green Gables, is my new um, favorite lady, <laughs> uh, actress-wise. Um, so she's absolutely fantastic as Queen Catherine on that show. It comes on the CWs on Thursdays at nine o'clock. So if you haven't watched that one, check it out. If you love kind of like period piece drama type things, absolutely fantastic. Um, let's see, what else am I watching? Um, I my go-to show is Once Upon a Time, and I absolutely love it. And uh, if you've been on this channel long enough, you'll notice that I have. Um, vlogs and a video from when I actually went up to Vancouver and watched them film the episode Kansas from season three. Uh, so if you're a fan of Once Upon a Time, go check those out. And I'm so behind in uh, editing those. My friend Jordan, uh, who went with me, uh, is constantly after me trying to get those to finish. And I promise I am going to try to get those done as soon as possible. So, um, any who's, let's see, listening to, oh, um, Particularly, I, I listen to all different types of music. Uh, today, it's kind of been a Celine Dion type day. Like, I just need to belt it out. You know what I mean? You just, you know, get in the shower and just have your own private concert and just, you know, let a rip tater chip and just sing it out. Um, so that's, you know, me in a nutshell. Uh, wanting. Uh, there's a lot of things that I want. Um, particularly, if let's just be honest, and we're all going to be honest here. Um, I'm at a place in my life, I'm 27 years old, I've been through a lot in the past several years and God has been with me every step of the way. Um, and I feel like I'm at this point in my life where I want to have somebody to share that with. And so being patient is very hard um, for me and I'm an A-type personality so I like to plan and I like to be in control of things. So. Um, just wanting and wanting that part of my life to start but most importantly just trying to learn to be patient and um, let God take care of it which I know he will and lastly loving okay so I'm loving um, all the fall candles um, leaves is always my favorite um, for Bath and Body Works um, but they have a new one that's called Sweater Weather, which is a, what I've got burning right here, which is absolutely fantastic. It's like cozy, and I also like the scent um, Autumn, and I have a lot of those plugged into my um, wall scents um, from Bath & Body Works as well. Um, of course, you know, who doesn't love the Pumpkin Spice Latte? Um, which I am still searching for the perfect way to make it at home because let's face it, Starbucks is expensive and um, yeah enough said um, as much as I love it um, my gift cards that my frog prince kids gave me for being assistant stage manager slowly no slowly who am I kidding quickly running out and so um, I'm on <sighs> the mission is to find the perfect pumpkin spice latte recipe to make it at home so do you have one? If you do, comment down below, and I will be eternally grateful. And I've rambled on for way, way, way too long, and you probably all think I'm absolutely bonkers, but, uh, <laughs> but you know, this is who I am, and um, as I always say, be true to you, and that's who I always, uh, I always try to be and convey on my blog. And so thank you for all of you out there who are reading my blog and commenting and um, just being uber supportive and I love you for it. Never in my wildest dreams did I think that my blog would um, get the views and, and support and readers that it would. So thank you so, so, so much. I can't wait to see all of your videos that you post for those of you who are also participating as well. 
And I also want to say a big thank you to Sarah from uh, 1227 who um, has been the sweetest person ever and I am so blessed that I have gotten to know her better um, through the Peony Project and also she's one of my sponsors this month so thank you Sarah um, you are truly heaven sent and I adore you bunches so thanks guys for watching and I'll see you next time bye